freaking place today. I had to run some errands for my parents and services. I had to help them pay some bills. Um, I had to freaking unpack and wash all the clothes because I have to pack now because I'm leaving tomorrow at like four to go to the airport to go to travel all the way to UAE. And it's going to be a long, long, whatever, 24 hours. And then my first flight's nine hours. That's crazy. So uh, <clears throat> last night I was, when, when we got home, from uh, the VidCon trip, I was like exporting and editing like a crazy person. I was I had the laptop going, I had that going, and I was like, dude, I was just running around. I got two vlogs up yesterday, <laughs> and we didn't miss a day. I mean, we missed we missed we missed a timely upload, but we still vlogged every day. You know, you know what I'm saying we still picked up the camera and vlogged every day, so. I mean, I think I think missing a day counts more as like we didn't pick up the camera and vlog at all, and there's <coughs> there's no vlog, so we <sighs> we technically didn't miss any days. We uploaded a video each each day. We did the yeah, we did. We uploaded a video every day, and one of them we exported wrong and had to private and re-upload because it just was so jittery. I accidentally forgot to uncheck something because I was tried rendering it in 720p instead of 1080p so that it would go faster and. I there's, accidentally there's a, did something wrong. There's a check button <laughs> in Vegas that I'm not sure what the point of it is for, but um, what we do is we go to the presets for um, the main concept. Is that what's called main concept MP4 or whatever? Um, and that's what our that's what all of our videos are. It's that particular preset because when you have the GPU acceleration, it goes really really fast. Even though we don't have that right now because the reasons that we already talked about before. But anyways, that's what we've been using because it looks the best to us. And we use what we do is we choose one of the presets, either either H, Internet HD 1080p or Internet HD 720p, and we change those <laughs> to how we want it, which is 23.976 frames per second. And there's one check mark in there that that says automatically adjust frame rate. 
and for whatever reason, every time that's checked, it splits the frame rate in half, which makes no sense to me whatsoever. Um, I want to contact Sony and ask them what the point of it is, but <laughs> there's really no point if you just uncheck it, then it's fine. But I told her about it, she didn't really know about it. I was in such a hurry, it was such a we, hectic we did day. It, we did it the first time, for the first video, which was 720p, and it worked out fine. Um, but we, we didn't save that as a preset. So the second day she thought she knew what she was doing and she did it herself and she forgot to uncheck that. So that's why it was like really jittery and we privated that video because people were thinking we did that on purpose. And now uh, we've done, we are exporting the open mic performance and we're about to put it on Terabyte. So if you want to go see that, go check it out. It's freaking like, let's see, it's 21 minutes. 21 minutes long, it's the longest terabyte video ever. It sounds like crap because it was shot on the flip and my dad, it looks like crap too because my dad used the zoom function on the flip which as we all know doesn't actually zoom in, it just zooms into the image which in turn causes it to be less than 720p. You're zooming into the pixels. We should have given which, this camera to him but I was, you know, I was, I was freaking out and we're I was sick. This was the day that, this was the next day after we got to VidCon and I barely had a voice and like I was freaking out, I'm like oh my god, oh my god, my voice is gonna crack, I'm, I'm she so bad, and like I wasn't thinking about the camera, I'm sorry. She warmed into it, but there's definitely some parts in ignorance where she... Yeah, ignorance, I couldn't hit that note. I, I got it a couple times, but I hope people don't give me like too much crap for And that as always, for some reason at the beginning, you you don't do as good and then you get better and better and better. Well, I mean, because I'm up, so, up there for the first time yeah. in front of everybody and then I, I kind of get a little more comfortable being on stage. But I feel like you did a really good performance for the You Now thing that we got. Oh my god, I know. Get. That's because directly after that we had just did the Annoying Orange thing. And yeah. going in front of that crowd was like, like going, made it, it, it made it like nothing singing on the You Now thing. Like I was just <clears> like. <throat> Whatever, I'll do it. The problem is we didn't record the you now thing. Did I know, I? please, anybody, if you if you witnessed us, if you vlogged there, recorded our any of our performance from our you now thingy in the you now exhibit, please video response it, send it to us, do something. I want to see it because we, I, had we had some random person playing drums and it was pretty fun. We we're jamming. <laughs> he had no idea what the drums were like for any of the songs. He was just wow. going with it. He didn't know who we are. We didn't know who he was. <laughs> and he was already on the drums. I, didn't, I felt bad, like, saying, get off the drums, we're going to take over. So I was like, you want to play drums for us? He's like, yeah, man. I was like, okay. And he's like, so how does the drums go? I was like, I guess if you just, like, hear a couple measures of it, can you just, like, slowly, like, work yourself into it? He's like, yeah, sure. I was like, okay. I mean, there were some, there were some things where I wish... He was hitting the snare on like a different beat, and it was kind of like yeah. knocking us <laughs> off time a little bit. But. Well, I noticed that like he, because I did ignorance on there too. I did ignorance much better on the you now thing than I did on the open mic because that was the next day. But he he totally played some something really nowhere close to the drums on ignorance, and like the ignorance drums are so specific in my mind. So I mean, it probably strange. It probably worked in his mind. Yeah. but he's never heard the song, so he, we were yeah, like, so "What's going on?" But, well, I wouldn't be able to improvise, so But yeah, kudos. if anyone has it, just, I want to see it. <laughs> I'm, really, I'm really curious as to what it was like. Even if you just recorded your you now screen. Sabrina's like dying. We just hit up Best Buy. Um, we, why is my light turning? Okay. We just hit up Best Buy and Sabrina wanted to get a new hard drive because the hard drive that we used to go to VidCon uh, didn't break, but it kept giving out and like kept stopping. giving out and stopping, and giving us problems. And it's a Seagate, and I've had issues with a lot of Seagates in my time, internal and external. And for some reason, I always go back to buying them. Just be I guess it's packaging or something about it, like the the speed, um, the speed specs on it is usually like a little bit higher than the than the Western Digitals. And I'm like, oh, well, I got the Seagate because it looks like it's a better better buy, and maybe I. Let's give another chance because maybe I just got like a lemon or something. Um, same thing with, I don't know. But anyways, so I th I've come to the conclusion that Seagate is the MacBook Pro of hard drives. And I'm just going to stop buying Seagate from now on. Unless they really like make some changes. Um, so we went to Best Buy and I was going to just tell her straight up, just get a Western Digital. But I saw this one, so we'll see. I've had a Lacy before. Um, some people say Lacy, but it's Lacy, I think. Um, 
and I had a, I had one before because it had Firewire 800 back when I had my MacBook Pro, and it's the only one that had Firewire 800 at the time, which is kind of weird. Well, that I could find at least, and I it wor it worked great for the Firewire 800. This one has Firewire 800 also, and 400, and USB 3.0, which is what she needs. But the reason I opted for this it stood out to us is because. because it's rugged. Um, has like triple protection, shock resistant, drop up to two meters. So she could drop this two meters and it shock Whoa, resistant, it's weird. good. We looked for a solid state one because there's no moving parts in solid state drives and it would just last a lot longer if she had a solid state external drive and it'd be faster. Although it'd be a lot more expensive, but you know, we can't afford to be losing these files and um, I don't know, but they didn't have any. They said that they're too expensive to put in their store or something. So, at least this one's shock resistant, which is nice. Um, my last let's see that I had, I think it might have broken. I think it broke also. So I'm going out on a limb and giving these people a chance because this is shock resistant. So um, don't do us wrong. Let's see. And um, if we like it, maybe you should send us some more. <laughs> you just got a PL. They said it wrong. <laughs>